Ladies and gentlemen, hello. Uh, today I'm trying something a little bit different. I am trying a live battle. Uh, let's see. Okay. Okay, cool. Um, so I'm trying a live battle uh, on with uh, XY battle spot singles. Oh, and I have an opponent. This is awesome. Um, so interesting. Rating starts off at. I wonder if rating starts off at 1500 or what. Anyway, I'm actually. Uh, the screen is misleading. Uh, I don't actually have uh, six Pokemon that I intend to use. I just intend to use three that I was using uh, for the Battle Chateau. Uh, and the other three are just filler to throw people off. I mean, I guess in theory there could be situations where I would swap it out. But for now, we're just going to start that off. So what I was trying to say before is that it looked like uh, rating starts off at 1500. In which case, they're probably using um, Glico, which makes me really happy. Uh, if they're actually using Glico. So yeah, that would be really cool. So I didn't actually look at what my opponent was doing. I'm really new to this. This is actually my first time on Battle Spot, so I really should have kind of written down what he was using. That was stupid of me. Okay, so Haxorus um, with Mold Breaker. Um, so I've got... Close Combat would do a lot. The question is whether I outspeed. Um, if he's Scarfed, then I don't have speed. Otherwise, I do. So, I'd say, yeah, let's go for the close combat. I could also go out into Aegis Slash, but he could, if he went for the EQ, that would be bad news. In which case, I could go out into Rotom, if he's locked in. Well, we'll see. We'll see. We will totally see. Um, I'm also not using, um, my usual cartridge. I'm using my Y cartridge instead of my X cartridge. I have reasons for this. Okay, so I have speed, so he's not scarfed, uh, and I don't take him out. But it will be a solid two-hit KO, so that is good. That's very, very good. And he dragon... Oh, this is amazing. He dragon dances. Oh, fantastic. Okay, so the question is, do I want to stay in? Or do I want... I think I'm going to stay in and just go for the... Uh... Close combat. Um... Yes, yeah, so oh, so he did go for the Earthquake, uh, but, you know, Rotom wouldn't have outsped. So I take me down my Sash, that was obvious, and I'm just going to take him out. Oh, he's Life Orb, okay, interesting. Uh, maybe I should have gone for the U-turn, but, you know, doesn't... Well, why would I... What, what would the end there? I was thinking it would wipe out my stat drops, but I'm at 1 HP. It doesn't really matter that I have stat drops. Uh, yeah, so I'm kind of wondering... Yeah, so that's awesome. I really wish I had paid attention to what his other Pokemon were. Charizard, okay, I've got the Stone Edge, so as long as it doesn't miss, that's the second KO for me. Um, so it's a Charizard Y, that's fantastic, that's even better. Watch this miss, watch this miss, I'm gonna cry. Uh, well, it, won't, it wouldn't be the end of the, well, I'd just be sad. Okay, so Drought is a thing, and Stone Edge, Stone Edge, Stone Edge, Stone Edge! Yeah! Woo woo! Woo woo! Woo woo! Okay, so this is starting off really well. Uh, I am a happy camper. So yeah, I I am going to be eager to hear feedback from you guys, both about the layout um, and about whether you enjoy these live narrations. I'm not going to do these all the time, and I definitely won't do this with anything except for Battle Spot, because I cannot stand long battles. If it's longer than 10 minutes, I am significantly less likely to watch a video on YouTube. Um, uh, yeah, so... So now it's a ditto. Okay, so he's copied my stats um, and probably scarfed. So now it's just a question of what he's going to lock in himself into. Okay, so um, yeah, actually, so no matter what he locks himself into, I'm set. So this is good game, sir. This is definitely, definitely good game. Uh, let's go for the CC. Uh, yeah, because either he locks himself into uh, Overheat, in which case I go out into Rotom, or he locks himself into one of the other three moves. Uh, wait. Yes, other three moves, in which case I go out into Aegis Slash and wall him. Yeah, it's so nice that Aegis Slash is not banned in, uh, in Battle Spot. So he goes for the close combat. That is phenomenally fantastic and awesome and all the great things in the world. Uh, because I don't have to worry about anything. So Infernape is going to go down. I don't care. I don't care. I'm just going to go out into Aegis Slash. Oh, this is so happy. This is a really great way to start, to start these things off. Um, so let's go for the Shadow Ball, and let's get the KO. Womp womp, sorry dude. Oh, it would have sucked if he actually weren't Scarfed. Although, then that would have been playing really risky. I guess it could have... Why don't people run Sash Ditto? That would be interesting. 
Anyway, take him out with a Shadow Ball at minus three defenses. That wasn't going to be a question. And that is the game. So I hope you folks enjoyed that little tiny battle. 2-0 victory. That's happy. And I wonder... So I, will it show me my rating? I haven't seen this before. Okay, so yeah, let's go ahead and save this as a battle video. Um, just in case anything happens. So battle video is saved. And I will catch you guys later. So long.